To get started, check out our vendor page on the DIR website for everything you need to know to become a vendor with us. Navigate to the DIR website, click on IT Solutions and Services, select Selling through DIR on the right-hand side of the page. You can also access this page via the IMA on the top of the homepage. Select Vendor from the drop-down menu. Here you'll find all of the information you need to become a DIR vendor, including hub-specific details, training opportunities, current solicitations, and more. It's important to note that there is no membership or list for becoming a DIR vendor. In fact, there are only two ways to sell through DIR, either by contracting directly through DIR as a prime vendor or by becoming a subcontractor or reseller with an existing vendor. In order to obtain a contract with DIR, all vendors must first respond to an open Request for Offers, or RFO, posted on our website under Schedule of Solicitation Opportunities. Here, you'll see all of the RFOs listed by phase. Look for the RFOs in the Planning, Pre-Solicitation, or Posting stages. Solicitations in the Posting phase are currently advertised on the state's marketplace. If there is an RFO that corresponds to the product or service category that your company offers, you should submit a response. Make sure to submit your response before the deadline to be considered for that RFO category. The solicitation schedule may change, so make sure to check DIR's website regularly. You can also become a subcontractor or reseller on an active DIR contract by partnering directly with a prime vendor. If you're interested in becoming a subcontractor or reseller, you'll need to contact the active contract holder or prime vendor directly. DIR also posts all RFOs on the Electronic State Business Daily or ESBD website. We also recommend registering for the Centralized Master Bidders List or CMBL through the Texas Comptroller's website. Once you are registered with the CMBL, you'll be notified of RFOs based on your CMBL profile. 